Digital Literacy Hello, my loyal YouTube video viewers Here, I will bring a video that is a very useful for you to watch can also be applied in life You can know But first, I saw hi and welcome to the video I thank you very much because you are willing to click and watch the video here. Let me invite you to watch my video today. But before that, I'm sorry in the information I gave was incomplete. I'm sorry I'm still a beginner. <laughs> Digital literacy is a medium that combines four types of work, namely reading, writing, even speaking to listening. With this combination, we can call it digital literacy, or maybe by utilizing good technology. These four types of digital literacy can develop well in the world of education and in the economic world. Maybe in addition to understanding digital literacy, I will also tell you that literacy has several parts of them. But before that, I quoted this session from a blog that I got on Google. Let's go on to the first part. There is a social networking here. Social networking it self refers more to the use of application because students or students will not risk to just one application but will use many applications. Process to the second part, namely, there is the transliteracy here which explain more about our efforts to ask the application wisely and use it according to our learning needs. We continue to the third part, namely, my think privacy and our efforts to ask the social media platforms that have been provided and use them wisely so that our future generation can revise positive things from the impact of using digital literacy. I quiet it before. I'm sorry. I quiet is because if I will convey everything, I'm afraid it will be too long and you will definitely get bored reading it. A little advice from me for my beloved audience you should use digital literacy media that has been provided properly and do not ask it for word things because it will have a bad impact on our next generation. Maybe from the point of my own understanding of digital literacy is an online media for people. If learns it through various applications that have been provided be that's the point I can convey if it's not clear I apologize but before I close this video here I will tell you that all the information I got same from one of the great youtubers and their great bloggers is Reisi Gi Regala and Wida Kurniasi I am very grateful to both of them for helping provide that information and my listening project can run very smoothly. Finally, thank you for those of you who have watched it. I hope you do not get bored watching my video mm, and see you in next video. Thank you very much and to my beloved viewers for watching this video until the end. I hope you guys get an information lesson from my video. Bye-bye.